hello guys welcome to my channel protocol gh and in today's video i want to show you how to put colors on the tembox cap so that whenever that it is moving you'll be able to see which one contains the ball so let's dig in before you start you have to click on this three button up there then you scroll down to developer mode if you are using kiwi browser you will get it but if you are on chrome and others I cannot guarantee you that you will get this so let's click on kiwi let's use kiwi browser to do this and more time to you will get it using a laptop that one is secured for you so when you come here watch where you have to go is that you click on this arrow top here so when you click on the arrow top there so right now what you have to do is that you have to go back to your one s bit and you click on the cap that you want to change the background so for in my case what i'll click on i'll click on this one i'll change this one first so i'll just click on it and i'll go back to the developer mode and you see it highlighted you see it highlighted so right now you can see that you have three different bottoms here and each bottom is indicating the cap so you can see these are the caps you can see here you have their data id data id so this one is two this one is one and this one is zero they use arrow to indicate them that's why i start from zero to one so what you have to do is that we need this one the shadow of this one so you click on it you click on it to open it to expand it sorry then so let's click on it to expand okay so when you expand it you will see this shadow you will see shadow here okay so you click on the shadow so right now click on element star this here you click on this one then we add background color so okay so right now you can see that it has suggest background color white here so that's what you choose background color white you choose this one background color white then after that we change it to blue so let's choose it okay so now it is white so let's change it to blue okay so we are done so now let's go back to one is better than confirm the blue okay now you can see that the background is blue let's go and change the other two too so what you have to do is that first of all we will click on this first before you go back to the to developer tool to change it so let's click on it then go back and it will highlight it okay so here is it you can open here then you click on it to expand it then you go to shadows as usual you go to shadows and so when you come to shadows we come here then you will repeat the same thing also background background color we can make it green choose this then you change it to green so let's type on it let's click on it then change it to green okay so we are done for this one let's go back and see our results and you can see that it is also green here it is also green here so what you have to do is that we go back to the third one then we complete the process you come back to the third one 
and here is the third one bottom data id one so bottom data id one we select it and we click on it to expand you click on the arrow there to expand it then you go to shadows okay so we go to zero sorry this is the one that we did so we go to button zero then we expand it then we go to shadows then we change the background color to here so background color you press space and go back it will give you suggestion then you choose white okay then you come back then you change it then we change it to let's take white so now we are done we have changed the background color to white so let's go and check it and see how it look like okay so this is how it look like this is how it look like so if you are playing you just click on play then you move on you bet then you move on so you can choose either at 1.45 or 1.25 it depends on how you want to play it but one trick that i want to give it to you is that this thing is not 100 percent that more time it will show to you so one thing that i want to tell you is that just bet responsibly then it's not for persons under 18 years and one thing to have to know is that don't refresh it don't refresh the page because immediately you refresh the page it will it will remove okay it will remove from there so let me show you how to use it in a real account so let me show you how to use it when you log in So guys right now you have seen how it is being used so right now let me teach you one thing let me just refresh the page and see and let's see how it will look like So after refreshing the page, you can see that it has reset. It has reset to the normal one. That's what I'm saying. When you apply the background to it, don't refresh it. So thanks for watching. Subscribe to my channel, Portugal GH. Bye for now.